In this video, I'm going to show you how to set the location for a machine in C Live. In order to perform this task, you need to be an authorized signer and have administrator privileges in C Live. To add or edit the location of an ePort device, we first need to click Devices under the General tab. On this screen, you can search for devices in different ways. If you search by region, click the plus sign next to your company name here. If you've set up regions for your business, click the plus sign next to the region in which your machine is found. Otherwise, just click No Region. If the location has not yet been set for a device, you will see the default location next to the device, which is your company name. So, obviously, you need to know the serial number of the device you want to edit or the location name that needs to be changed if it is already set up. The other way to search is by serial number directly. To make this demonstration simple, we will use this method since we already know the device number we want to edit. So we simply enter the serial number in this field and click Search. The search result will display the link for only this device. Click anywhere on the line to open the detail page. Now if the location is already set and we have moved the machine to a different location, we just need to edit the information in the required fields to change it. If the location has not yet been set, the fields will be blank and we'll need to enter the information for the first time. All the fields marked with a red asterisk are required in order to complete the edit. For the city and state fields, you can enter the zip code here, and when you hit your tab key on the keyboard or click outside the field, the city and state fields will be automatically populated. The specific location will be the location in the building or the location on the company campus where the cabinet has been placed. This helps you know precisely where the machine is at your customer's location. For locations in Canada, Bermuda, or Guam, you'll need to click the drop-down arrow here, select the correct country or territory, then enter the postal code here to get the city and province or state. When you're satisfied all the location information is accurate, scroll to the bottom of the page and click the Save Changes button. This will take you back to the top of the device information page and Seed Live will provide this confirmation saying the device has been successfully updated. To go back to the device list page, simply click Devices on the menu bar. And that concludes this video.